New at five, the man convicted of killing two people in an illegal drag race will spend 14 years in prison. Bruce Harrison spent the day with one of the victim's families as they waited for James Malone to learn his punishment. Just seconds before Malone hit the two young men, the court said he was speeding 123 miles an hour. Today, the victim's families found out how Malone is paying for his egregious act of reckless driving. The Wellinger family has been waiting for this day for nearly a year. How are you feeling this morning? Um, very sad, very anxious, and also um, very happy that this has finally come and that we can finally get justice for Gerald. Gerald Wellinger and his childhood friend Devante Gaines were killed on August 7th last year. Before the court sentenced James Malone, Gerald's mom, Julie, spoke. My son will never be able to see his nieces grow up and will never get to meet his new nephew that will be born soon. Malone also addressed the court. I just want the family just, just to listen to me. But I know it's going to be hard for them to accept my apology. But I truly am sorry for their loss. Judge J.D. Watts made his decision. The defendant's sentence in count one is 21 years in the Wisconsin State Prison. Watts sentenced Malone to 21 years on both counts. And for good character, he says Malone will serve the sentences concurrently. That means combined he'll do 14 years locked up and seven years supervised release. It wasn't what you were hoping for. Um, no. My brother was 22. Devante was 22. The man didn't even get that amount of years. His family was upset and crying, but they can call him later. They will see him tomorrow. And we have to go through life not knowing what their life would have been like because him and the other guy decided to be reckless. Reporting in Milwaukee, Bruce Harrison, TMJ4 News.